Hi, hello and welcome to Designer by Design. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a parallax effect the easy way using PowerPoint. The effect itself is really cool and you will see movement of foreground and background images at different speed creating an illusion. Alright, let's get started. Layering the objects is important for this effect, so keep the selection pane open. Now I'm going to add images. First, choose a background image and name it in the selection pane. Next, add an object that will be used to change its position relative to this background. In this example, I have a picture of a moon that will move in the sky. Next, add your title text. Format the text to the desired size and position it on top of the background image. This text would sync in the foreground image that we will add now. I found this image for the foreground, but it already had the background mountains, so I had to remove them. Now that the images has been added, let's see how to create the parallax effect. I'm going to show you the easy way by using only one animation effect, that is line motion path. So now open your animation pane, select the background image, that's the mountain with sky. From the animation menu, click the drop down and select line from the motion path section. The green dot indicates the start position and the red dot indicates the end position. The end position of this image should be placed above the slide. So zoom out your slide, click and drag the red dot to place the image over the slide height like this. Set the animation duration to 4 seconds. This tells PowerPoint to move this image from the start position to the end position in 4 seconds. Next, select the object on top of the background image, that is the moon. Once selected, select the line motion path animation for this. To create the parallax effect, the moon will move in different direction. Click and drag the red end to move in the northwest direction and outside the slide like this. Set the start action as with previous and duration to 3 seconds. This tells PowerPoint to move the moon along with the background image but with different speed. Next. Select the foreground image and apply line motion path. The foreground image will also move in the same direction as the background image and at the same speed. So select start with previous and set duration as 4 seconds. Next select the text and apply the line motion path animation. To create the sync in foreground effect, drag the end position to just a little over the current position. This would start at the same time and set the duration as 3 seconds as like the moon. Finally, to transition to next slide, make sure the slide color matches the color theme. To do that, I am drawing a rectangle. From the shape fill, select eyedropper and pick a color from the picture. Make all of your slides with the same background. The slide following the title slide will be added to the bottom of the slide so it moves up along with the foreground image. The easy way is to make the foreground image and the slide as a group and apply the line motion path. Drag the end position based on your slide content. The key here is all objects start at the same time but travel with different speed or duration. 
Let's see how this works. Isn't it amazing? I hope this video is helpful to create parallax effect of your own. If you liked it, leave a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Forget not to subscribe to Designer by Design and click the bell icon for notification. See you in another video. Bye now.